guys, it's Lauren Menardi with Breezeway Productions and we're here at the LA Film Festival about to watch the feature film of Izzy Gets the Fuck Around Town. We're about to talk to the actors and actresses. We cannot wait. Hi Mackenzie, congratulations on this film. What an accomplishment. Can you tell us a little bit about your character and how you relate to her as a person? Yeah, I play a character called Izzy and um, I uh, she was sort of inspired by riot girl culture and this sort of um, anti-establishment girl of the 90s and and uh, I, I related to her urgency and getting shit done. And um, yeah, it was great. It was a very succinct like journey. She has to. She has one singular goal, and it was um, it was really fun to play somebody all over the course of one day. And I really enjoyed it. So this title is quite interesting. Yeah. Can you tell us yeah. a little bit about how you came up with that? The title is a not sellout title. Um, it goes for broke. It goes for the throat. I mean, it is inspired. The movie is inspired by. By, um, riot girl punk culture and so the title goes along with that concept and the ide idea of we're not going to sell out we're here we're not corporate that's the whole thing and the character of the movie kind of de deals with that idea of am I going to sort of sell my life out or am I going to sort of like stay true to who I am as a person and so the title isn't just a I mean yeah it's a catchy marketing thing right people are really interested in it but it also has a lot to do with the story and what the heart of the story is. Hi Salome, it's so nice to meet you. How has your role been in this film and what has been your favorite part? Um, so I play Gypsy in the film um, and it's it was just really fun just playing around with it. Very comedic character, really bizarre. Um, I haven't seen the film yet. I wasn't there for the screen so I'm a little bit... <laughs> I'm excited to see how it how it looks, yeah. And then what was the, your favorite part or the funniest part of filming? Um, I would say, uh, so I had to have an accent, a really bizarre accent. Um, and that would have been the most fun to play around with, yeah. What was the accent? Can you give us a little bit of a demo? Uh, it, gosh, I, it was like a mixture of like... I don't even know. Um, I, I, in the audition, I just pulled something out, and then when I got hired, I was like, okay, I guess I have to do the same thing. <laughs> How do I do that again? Yeah. Um. Okay, so tell us a little bit about your acting career and the role that you play here in this film. Sure. Um, I've been acting most of my life since I was young, um, and this movie is cool. I have the teeniest part in it, but I loved the script, and I love Mackenzie, and Mackenzie was like, do you want to be young me? And I was like, I would love to. So yeah, I play young her. What, what was it about the script that really drew you in? It's just, Izzy is such a cool character. I think she's so driven, and it's cool to see a woman so wild on the screen. I really loved that. So Keith, you're at the LA Film Festival. How has your experience been here so far? I literally just got here, um, but it's cool. Um, I support it. I've been here a couple times. They always have cool little films to check out, so I'm just here supporting. Awesome. And tell us a little bit about your role in this film. Um, I don't even really remember it that much, and it's kind of sad, but we did the movie a long, long time ago. But basically, I just played one of the many love interests in this girl's story who's traveling around attempting to find love. She bumps into, unfortunately or fortunately, my character. Wow, so much talent on this red carpet. We are so proud of the actors and actresses. We spoke to people like Mackenzie Davis and Ryan Simpkins. This is Lauren Menardi, and you're watching Breezeway Productions.